hello in this tutorial i'll show you how to track business goals and projects in notion tracking business goals and projects in notion can help you stay organized and manage your workflow effectively notions flexibility allows you to create custom dashboards track progress and collaborate with team members now here's a step-by-step -step guide to setting up the system for tracking business goals and projects First thing you need to do is to launch Notion on your desktop, which of course you've done right here. And then on the left side bar, go ahead and click on this pencil and note icon to create a new page. Then you need to name your page. So in this sense, it's going to be business goals and project then click on enter for you to start your note so on your new page you're gonna have to use the backward slash prompt and typing table so you can use the add simple tabla content to your page or add a table view for a new or existing data so i'm just using the new one then in here you can fit table to page weight so that it can be expanded and can just give you a more expanded view then you can customize columns for your goals in your first column you could name it goal and in the next column you can name it description and you can click on the plus over here to add a new column and click on fit page so with and here it could be due date and you can click on the plus icon as well and click on that we table the page with here it could be status and you can add another we table the page weight and this could be priority and you can use owner as well you can add another one for owner and you can add another one for progress these metrics will actually help you analyze your business goal progress wasn't spelled correctly now there's something i also like you to learn how to do so once you click on that, you can head over to options and click on header row. So you can customize or make your header row stand out from others. So for the goal, it means you can use a text column for the name of the goal. And for description, you can use a multi-line text column for details about your goal. And you can select column to track progress and select column to indicate priority level and the owner column is a person going to assign goal to a member and for the progress is a number column for tracking progress percentage or a progress bar so that is pretty much how you can get this done now i would like you to know that you can also uh customize your table all right you can head over to this three dots icon and use any of the options here available and you can also click on those three dots over here to customize it further you can change the fonts if you want to and use any of the steps available here and over here at the top corner you can click on add cover to add a picture you can add a comment or you can even add an icon just go ahead and freestyle and you will be good to go so you can go ahead and click on that and of course instead above instead below if you want to or just go ahead and do what you want to do this way you will be able to track your business goals and your your projects as well there are a wide variety of all the steps that you can take but this one is simpler and actually help you to effectively track and manage your business goal and projects within Notion, providing a clear overview and organized structure for your workflow. 
so you can go by the tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and of course once you are done you will be good to go i hope this tutorial mapped helped you search